Night of Destruction number one, the first one of season three, 2015 of the Low Budgets is here. And Tommy, it's been a wild time getting up to this point, but we made it. There's so many cars ready yeah. to go in that pit area. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous is an understatement. Yeah. Jeffrey, there are so many cars that we don't know if it's going to start or blow up. Either one, we'll find out. Yeah. But we're going to get this thing going with the flagpole race, Jeffrey. Not, not that many times we've done a flagpole race. I feel like I've got a pretty good hot rod just by the looks of this thing. I know that I'm going to win tonight. What about you? You know you're going to win. Look at my car. Well, Tommy, I feel, I feel decent. You know why? Why? Because I'm not driving the damn runt. That's why. That's a great start. <laughs> it is a good start. <laughs> so what I'm kind of looking into this, I'm driving an old demolition derby car, and uh, you guys just fixed the hood on this thing, like right before I went out. Yeah. I was a little bit skeptical about that, but you know what? I'm also excited because now, now I can see can, where I'm going. Yeah, exactly. Now you can see a little bit more. Jeffrey, my car, this thing is banged up. It ran a demolition derby not too long ago yeah. last year. But hey, it still ran. We got it to fire up that one day. That's right. And that's all the encouragement we need. So uh, we're going to go out there. 23 flagpole race cars. It's going to be a lot of fun. Yes. It seems like the field's getting bigger and better. We're doing it at the nighttime, and this track is pretty tight. And a special thing for the first time ever on the low budget. We're hooking some of us up with microphones. Oh, man. So, ladies and gentlemen, those in-cars are going to get that much more interesting. I just want to make sure that I make more than a half a lap. I'm not in the run this time. I'm excited about tonight. You ready to go racing? Let's go racing. Flagpole racing coming up next. All right, folks. We finally got some microphones to go with us. Let the games begin. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is now time for the first ever The Low Budget has hooked up microphones. Uh, I'd say we made it with some, uh, maybe some comfort, but I'm not gonna say that till the end of the night for when I know that we're all good. I can't see behind me, you can't see behind me. So let's see if I have any crap talking to do during this race. Welcome, Night of Destruction number one, 2015 is about to begin. Literally, I am, I am just, I'm right there. I hear someone. Look at that beautiful car! I can't say I'm nervous, I'm actually really excited. You know, we're, we're there, we're finally there. Um, the trailer car is handling great. 86 Tommy Mason is slipped, Gene 66 Michael Lynn was the 14. I love this start already. Holy shit. Here we go! Hey! Oh my gosh, I've never actually done a full uh, flagpole race. We'll see how this goes. I'm low on gas. You ready for this to go?
busy right now. You want me to get it? See now why the guy was only using reverse. I didn't notice that his hood is so bent up over the driver's windshield that he can't see where he's going. In fact, there he is over on the back straightaway with the hood up, and I don't think he knows he's on the back straightaway. Double zero has re-entered the fray. Ah, I use that term loosely. <laughs> Your GoPro's gone. Is it? Yeah. What are we Megan Lap. 
I'm gonna be a pet. That was perfect. We hit a camera right there and everything. Someone lost a tire. Oh, someone got stuck in the best place possible. My windshield's about to fall in on me right now. Usually I wear gloves for these events, and of course this was the event where I'm like, oh, I'll be fine. Luckily, a uh, helmet kept the glass out of my eyes. <laughs> I was worried when they wanted to fix my hood, uh, which they did. Um, it was a good fix, it needed to be done, but man, it uh, it took its toll. Uh, because initially the hood was buckled, so all the air was pushing it down. Now that it's like this, the air is picking up underneath. All right, we're about to continue. This is uh, the one that hopefully goes a lot better than this did. That sucked. Oh, my shifter broke! <laughs> Whatever. And what happened? You couldn't see anything? Twice. Twice? Twice. What happened to you? I Tom. don't even know. Flagpole racing. 20 laps, 
And somehow you and I both managed, I think, to complete five. Jeffrey, my hood is like 20 times heavier than yours. Yeah. And it flew open. The funniest part is I knew it was going to. Tommy, your hood didn't just fly open in this race from what I saw. It peeled. It ended up on the side. I've never seen a hood do that. I got to thank Kevin for trying. You can see him trying to work on that hood. Uh, He he fell out of the race early. I can't see it, actually. You know why? Because the GoPro flew away. Somebody lost the GoPro. Well, you can hear me talking to him, at least. Yeah, yeah. And uh, he was working on that hood, twisting it around, trying to get it undone break off however the hinges can go but it just fell off to the side of the car so i said well you know what i'll just go out there and run laps and get in the way and cause sparks you and i met up at one point in the infield because we were having the same issue Uh my hood opened up as well and it was a very kind of a scary situation because of course i wasn't wearing gloves in this one and the windshield came cracking in now we fixed it i pushed it back over and then it came smashing in again. That second smash, I was ready. I mean, the windshield, I felt like, was in my lap at that point. Yeah, it was. And it's not a fun thing to worry about glass shattering no. all over the driver's seat. Yeah. Uh, for me, the fire rescue guys took me out. Not that I was surprised. That, right. the, that hood was sparking pretty good, as you can see in the wall cameras. And so they didn't want any more damage done to that. Yeah, and like I said, I was kind of nervous about that hood getting fixed, my hood getting fixed earlier today. But you know what? Hey. It, this stuff happens. We're low budget. Absolutely. So, so <laughs> where I think I finished nineteenth. You finished. I finished twenty first. Twenty first. Yep. So, so what would you say? A, a good start to the night? Yeah. If you call us bad, we're then we're good. <laughs> All right. Well, next up, folks. What's next? Oh. There's so many things to worry about. Oh, How Tommy. About a chain race. No. Before that, we're going auto soccer. Oh, look folks. out! And this we're, is gonna hurt. This is gonna hurt a lot. Auto soccer coming up next.